Grant, thanks for joining us uh, on on what is your first day as a Rovers player. Um, it's a bit too early to say maybe, but how you find it so far? Nah, I've enjoyed my, my first morning. Um, getting the fitness testing out of the way is always, the uh, start of pre-season is always dreaded, but it has to be done and um, no, nah, I've enjoyed it. Uh, you're, a, you're a player, looking at yourself in your own career, um, you're a player that has played against Rovers a number of times in your career at Hamilton. Uh, uh, tell us a bit about yourself, what position you prefer, what are your main strengths and assets? Um, my favourite position is central midfield, um, mostly defensive midfield. Um, uh, I like to go on the ball, I like to, um, I like to get it down, I like to pass it. I um, also don't mind getting and doing the other, the other side of the game, you know, breaking the play up and, and doing the defensive side. Um, and probably um, him to watch me play, knowing that I don't mind a, a good tackle. Um, and uh, maybe getting on the wrong side of the referee sometimes. But um, no, I would say that's my, my main attributes. And, and you came through the ranks uh, at Hamilton. Um, who is it that brought you into the first team there? And, and who? What did you encounter there that you've that you've that you now see at uh, Wraith Rovers and in the Canterbury? Um the manager at the time was, was Billy Reid. Um he gave me my first start. Um I think it was away to Dundee. I was only sixteen. Um, so I remember coming through and you know, like say Ian Davidson, I remember playing against him when he was at Dundee and we were challenging for the league um the, the year that they got promoted and then we ended up beating Hibs. Uh, through the playoffs, um, and obviously I played with Cat as well. Cat was our goalkeeper uh, at the time we beat Hibs as well. So um, there's a few few faces I've known personally, and then obviously a few few boys that I played against throughout the years. Yeah. And some we were talking to um, the striker Chris Duggan about was um, looking at the season coming up. Obviously you've been at Premier and Championship level so far in your career. Looking at this League One campaign, there's some. There's some good teams down here with us. Uh, we're taking nothing for granted. What do you see as the main, uh, the main obstacles in the front of the for this season? Um, well, it's like you said, there is a, a good standard of teams in this league. Um, obviously, I'm, I've never played in this league before, but it's something I'm looking forward to. Uh, I've played against most of the teams in this league, so I know what we're going to come up against. Um, and from an outside of looking in from last season, I think that our biggest obstacle this season is going to be getting over the disappointment of last season but I think the players that are here have got the character to do that um, it's going to be a challenge but I'm excited for the challenge um, and I think um, you get the best out of players when they've got something to prove and something to, to put right um, and I think this season um, it's, a, it's a great challenge for us and I firmly believe that if we play our potential I'd, there's no reason why we can't win the championship. Great. Well, that's the sort of thing we want to hear. Thanks for that, and uh, good luck for the season. Thanks a lot. Cheers. Cheers. Thanks.